Jeff Keenan here. Today I wanted to do a quick video uh, when using a Ruckus Zone Director on how to set up a separate SSID for 5 gigahertz only and then another one for 2.4 and 5 gigahertz. A reason you'd want to do this is maybe if you've had some uh, devices that are in a fixed location that are close to the access point and you wanted to make sure they're always only connecting to 5 gigahertz or not moving around um, then you can assign those to the 5 gigahertz only SSID. Um, the other clients that are dual band that are moving around you probably want them to go on the SSID that has both 2.4 and 5 because as they roam farther away um, you know you may only be able to get a 2.4 gigahertz signal. So there is a way to do this in the Ruckus uh, Zone Director 1200. Uh, I'm working with one with uh, version 10.1 firmware and I'm gonna go over how to do that. For my setup, I wanna have two SSIDs, one called Ruckus and one called Ruckus 5G for the five gigahertz only. I want the Ruckus SSID to have both 2.4 and five. So the first thing you need to do is create a new uh, WLAN group. Right here, I created one called 5G only. To this group, I added both my SSID Ruckus and my SSID Ruckus 5G. In your default group, I only have SSID Ruckus. Next, you go to your access points in your system default group. You're gonna edit this. On your 2.4 gigahertz radio, I'm gonna set that to default group. On my five gigahertz radio, I'm gonna set that to 5G only. Now just to verify, um, we can go back to wireless lands, click on the Ruckus 5G SSID, and notice that only five gigahertz clients are connected to this one. I also verified with a 2.4 gigahertz client bridge that the Ruckus 5G SSID isn't being broadcast on the 2.4 band. So I hope this video was helpful. Um, it's not very intuitive to um, configure this setup with uh, separate SSIDs uh, for five gigahertz only. Um, if you have any questions about Ruckus Wireless, please feel free to email me, keenanj at keenansystems.com. I can send you quotes on any of the equipment or help you with your license upgrades or anything else uh, having to do with Ruckus. And again, please remember to like and subscribe for more help with wireless networking.